Welcome to the 2020-2021 Back to School Night for Thomas Edison Language Institute. I'm Jamal Hicks, one of your vice principals. This is a message from your administrators and your counselors. Heidi Gardner is the principal. Laura Valencia is the other vice principal. Vanessa Landeros is a counselor. She will be servicing the fourth grade through eighth grade English immersion and dual immersion. And then um, for the eighth grade, she'll be servicing the eighth grade dual immersion. Mr. Greg will be servicing our TKers through third grade, and that's both English immersion and dual immersion. And he'll also service our eighth grade English immersion. Again, Mr. Greg will be TK through third English immersion and dual immersion. And he'll also add on the eighth grade English Emerging. School communication is vital during distance learning. We want to make sure that the communication line is open on both ends. So our school website is www.sanjuan.edu slash Edison. I just point that up because we actually have distance learning hub I'll go into a little bit later, but you that's probably the best way to actually access our hub is to go through our school webpage. Our school phone number is 916-979 8960. Our COVID-19 office hours are 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Please, when you come in, we will be practicing social distancing and you must have a mask. If you don't have a mask, we will provide you with one, okay? We do offer on-site technical help with Mr. Gattenbein. He will be here from 7.30 a.m. to 8.30 a.m. And during this in-person uh, technical support, you can bring your computer in and hopefully he can solve the problem right there for you. Our distance learning hub. There is the long website and I'll talk more about there later, but the, the distance learning hub is where everything is happening. Let's take a look into it. I don't expect you to remember that entire web address or be able to type it in correctly. If you, can, if you did, good for you. I can't do it. So really the best way to access our, our, our distance learning hub is to go to our Thomas Edison webpage. Our school webpage is www.sanjuan.edu slash Edison. Again, to get to the Thomas Edison webpage, you want to go to www.sanjuan.edu slash Edison. Once you go there, you're going to see distance learning right there. So you can go right here to take me to the hub, or if you like, you can go to the hub over here. So let's go to Edison Distance Learning Hub. This hub is just what really an answer to what the parents, the teachers, the students, everybody wanted. They wanted a place where all in one location access our learning. And that's what the hub does though, right here for you. So if, for example, we have a, dis, a parent resources tab right there. And this, this actually page just to kind of just support the parents in distance learning. There's some tips, family resources, internet access. There, there's some trainings that will be going on. Um, that's really a big push right now because here's all this technology and um, the, the parents are now responsible for making sure the students are doing it, but we got to make sure our parents know what's going on, our parents and know exactly what's going on. Uh, what, what we'll be doing also is um, we'll be serving meals. Our meals will start, we'll serve a hot breakfast and a, a cold lunch. Our meals Monday through Friday, it starts from 7 a.m to 8.30, you could just, just drive up to Edison and get your meal. You wanna make sure that you have completed a meal application. There is that right there. You can do the meal application right there from the hub. Again, going from parent resources, we do have some student support services. This is a trying time. This is just different learning for everybody involved. So we do have some student support services. So if your child, if your student is having some, you know, just needing a little bit more support, please direct them to this page right here. There are some things right there for them that could actually help them with their distance learning. There is a dual immersion tab right here. And just during, through distance learning, just the time that Spanish, you need to be speaking Spanish and English at all times. And you don't get that with the distance learning model. Bilingualism is not happening in distance learning. So just here, this page right here, I really want to highlight this page for our dual immersion parents, our dual immersion students. There's just some activities right here that can actually support your, your students and kind of fill in that gap that maybe distance learning isn't providing for your student. From the dual immersion page right there, we do have our counselor resources in the page right here. So this is where our, here are our counselors, Vanessa and Greg, they're right there. They list their office hours. 
Greg is uh, Tuesday, Thursday from 12 to 1 p.m. And Vanessa is Tuesday, Thursday from 1 to 2 p.m. And actually right here, this is where um, they have some activities for the students. They, yeah, there's just in this page right here, you can actually interact and see some of the services that our counselors actually um, provide. Let's say, for instance, a student or someone you may know may need to make an appointment with one of our counselors. They would just come right here to our counselor's corner and they could just schedule an appointment right there. Right from there, they could just fill it out and it will go directly to our counselors, okay? And they will be contacting your student or your friend or whoever needs the support. Going from there, one of the challenges that we found with distance learning is there's times when you can't get a hold of anybody. And so what we had provided right there is we actually provided a distance learning support ticket. And so really with this ticket, you can actually even use it when we are available. But this really, uh, the whole purpose of this ticket is if your student is having any issues with distance learning, we're here to support learning at home. So please just let us know if it's a problem with the device, if it's a problem with the internet, or just if they're just having just challenges with the class, please fill out this distance learning ticket. What, what happens, just to let you know what happens with this ticket is that it goes right to administration and then it will also go to the teacher. So the teacher knows that there is a student in their class that needs some type of support. Again, how to access it, you want to just find your student's class, find your student teacher, and let's say, for example, if it was fifth grade, I would click on, if I have a student in fifth grade, I would click on the fifth grade hub, and then I would just find your, all our teachers in the fifth grade, and you would just click on the teacher that your student has, and you can find the schedule, or if you want to even access the Google Classroom. Some of the hubs actually have the Zoom tabs on them, so um, if you're having issues just with connecting with Zoom, if you want a really quick and fast way to, uh, access Zoom, I really uh, highly recommend that you go into the hub and, and really into the, the teacher's hub. Um, lastly, one of the last things I really want to talk about is the principal's corner. We do have a principal's corner. So if you do need to reach out, if you forgot our email, you're not writing it down. Here are our emails right there for your administrators. And then we have our, our virtual office. This is kind of the new end thing, this bit emoji. So we kind of played around with it. A little bit, but if you wanted to, uh, what will happen each week is we there will be a principal's message. If you would like to see that message, you would just click on right there, and then you will see the principal's message. If you want to leave us a message, click on the phone, and you can record a message to us. And that is real. I'm just we got the parent resources. Okay, so again, the stuff at the bottom is just quick access to everything right there. Um, but again. Thank you for coming to Back to School Night. Thank you for listening. We're in this together. We'll get through this together. I'd like to end this session with a quote that really resonated with me. Edison family, it might be stormy now, but rain does not last forever. We're not in this forever, okay? Let's be in this together. Thank you, and have a good evening.